الذين ينفقون في السراء والضراء والكاذمين الغيث والعافين عن الناس والله يحب المحسنين Those who give at the time of ease and the time of difficulty and those who restrain their anger and those who forgive the others and verily Allah loves the doers of good the ones who give at the time of ease and difficulty because it's easy to give at the time of ease when you have money but when you the times are rough and the ummah needs money the masjid needs money your brothers in Syria need money, wherever it is, the ummah's in need. It's difficult, you don't have that much money. That's when it becomes difficult. That's the true test. And that's why the Prophet wasallam said, as burhan. That the sadaqah is burhan, it's evidence of your iman. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala told us, لَن تَنَالُوا الْبِرَّ حَتَّى تُنْفِقُوا مِمَّا تُحِبُّونَ that you will never gain the bir, which is all that is good. You will never gain the bir until you give from that what you love. The Prophet wasallam, when he told us to fear the nar, to fear the hellfire, he told us alayhi salatu wasalam, فَاتَّقُوا النَّارُ وَلَوْ بِشِقِّ تَمْرَ And fear the hellfire even if it's with a half of a date, something that small. You have to give from what you love. The second characteristic, وَالْكَاذِمِينَ الْغَيْثِ The one who restrains his anger. Because as the Prophet wasallam told us, لَيْسَ الشَّدِيدُ بِالسُّرَعَ وَإِنَّمَا الشَّدِيدُ وَالَّذِي يَمْلِكُ نَفْسُهُ إِنْدَ الْغَضَبِ That the one who can wrestle and beat people down, he's not the strong one. The strong one is the one who can restrain himself at the time of anger. He can control his anger. And the Prophet wasallam told us that the one who restrains his anger solely for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala وَهُوَ قَادِرٌ عَلَىٰ أَنْ يُنْقِذَهُ He has the ability to do something about it. Meaning he's somebody who has power, somebody who has the ability to get revenge. But he restrains his anger. For Allah, what's going to happen to him on the Day of Judgment? Yunadihi Allah. Amam al khalaiq Allah will call him in front of all of the creation. Yukhayyiruhum in al hur al in ma sha. Allah will let him choose from the hur al in what he wants. The one who restrains his anger. How many difficulties have we fallen into in our lives because we couldn't control our angers? Wal kadimin al ghayb. Wal afin an al nas. And those who forgive. Abdullah ibn Amr. He said, I heard the Prophet on the member saying, Irhamu turhamu. Ighfiru yaghfir Allahu lakum. Have mercy, Allah will have mercy with you. Forgive and Allah will forgive you. Allah tells us, Wal ya'fu wal yasfahu. Ala tuhibbuna ay yaghfir Allahu lakum. And forgive and forget. Don't you want Allah to forgive you? If we really want to be from the muttaqeen, we have to forgive and forget our brothers. Nobody's perfect. Everybody makes mistakes. But the best of the Muslim is the one who forgives. That's why the Prophet ﷺ taught us that the one who starts with the salam after they've had a difference of opinion, and they're not giving salams to one another. He said, man bada salam. And the best of them is the one who starts with the salam. To forgive and forgive you, forget what your brother.